Hello guys, welcome to the finale of my God of War 2 Let's Play. In the last episode we made our way through the Temple of the Fate and we've now finally made it here where we can turn back time. It's now time for Kratos to finally get his revenge on Zeus. Let's see what this does. So it's lowered some kind of tapes. They look like tapes, don't they? I don't know if they really are tapes in this game, but... That's what they look like, so I might as well just call them tapes. So we need to turn one of those specifically if we are to go back to time, to return to the time where Zeus portrayed Kratos, so we can get our revenge. So we need to turn one specific one. So if I turn this one, I don't think it's going to be this one. When, it, when you see a crack on the screen, that's when you know it's not the right one. Actually, come to think of all the orbs I have, let's see what I can upgrade. Um, let's see what I can upgrade. I just want to see if I can upgrade any weapons before we head on. Typhon's Bane. Hmm, yeah, why not? Why not go for Typhon's Bane? Get us upgraded. This could come in handy against Zeus. So that's now maximum power, that is great. So if I remember correctly, I think it was this one, I think, that we had to use to turn back time. I do definitely remember this part of the game quite well, obviously, because this is where we finally get our revenge on Zeus. Or where the end begins to finally take down Zeus. So where is it? Where's the time Zeus stabbed Kratos? There it is. Right, let's go. Slow down time so it'll make things a bit quicker for us. So once we get to there, we can finally take down Zeus. Show him he's, he betrayed the wrong guy. People should know by now, betraying Kratos is never a good idea. Because if you do, he will do whatever it takes to get his revenge. Literally. Here we are. All right, Zeus, I'm coming for you. Even now, as you draw your last breath, you continue to defy me? No matter. What? How can this be? The Sisters of Fate have aided you. Unexpected. The Sisters are dead. I underestimated you. A mistake I do not intend to repeat. Okay, this is going to get interesting. Two of the most powerful men in Greek mythology going at it. So now it's time for Kratos to finally get his revenge. He's summoning these guys against us. So I've got a new blade to help me out here. Just kind of the in the end of the first game, we've got another blade to help us out. I think I can swap weapons though, or maybe not just yet. So I can use one weapon. I can still use my magic abilities, I think. I hope I can. Yes. I could definitely use that anyway. Can I use the bow? Yes, I can. Okay, that's good. I I've lost a lot of bit of health already. Anyway, let's take out these guys with the rage of the time wise. Well. Okay, here we go. There we go. Let's go and annoy Zeus. Let's grab this one as well. 
So we need to stun Zeus by taking out these creatures he's summoned against us. So I'm getting all my health back, which is great. Okay, let's grab this one. Another one bites the dust. I think I do this quite a few times. Okay, let's attack Zeus's hand. Oh, I can't do that. When Zeus lowers his hand, that's when you can attack his hand. I might as well use the Chrono's Rage here. Because we do get... We do get some magic back every time we stun Zeus. There we go. Right, let's quickly grab this one. Right, that's him. He's stunned again. Is he going to do it again? Let's tack his hand. Okay, another stun should do it. Then we can tack Zeus's hand again. Come on, lower your hand. It's going to take a few hits, I think, on Zeus's hand if we're to take him down. Okay, so at least we are doing damage to Zeus, trust me. We may not look like we are, but we are doing damage to Zeus. I need to grab this woman quickly. Okay, stun Zeus again. Get some magic and health back. And now... I can then... Oh, oh he had to stun me, didn't he? Oh, okay, we'll just do it to one of these guys again, and then we can stun Zeus again. I have to jump in the air before he slaps. Yep, there we go. There we go. Now we've got him. So now Zeus has shrunk down to normal size, and we can find we can finally fight each other. Like I don't know if my Chronos Rage is going to work on Zeus, especially considering that he does have lots of electricity and magical abilities. Although he's doing hits to him, so yeah. I might try and deflect some of his magic back. That'll do some damage to him. I'll do this. All <laughs> oh, this is doing some good damage to Zeus. Although this is wasting a lot of my magic, but still. This is one hell of a fight. I mean, two of the most strongest men in Greek mythology going at it. But will Kratos get his revenge here and now? This part here, I don't think most of the God of War 2 story really builds up God of War 3 enough. But I think the ending of this game, once we get Zeus, that's where the story of God of War 3 really builds up. And that's where Kratos' story revenge really gets interesting. I've just died. What the fuck? Right, let's do this again. How the hell... Did he kill me? His electricity abilities are doing quite a bit of damage. Okay, I guess I underestimate how much damage it's doing. Actually, if I get the Rage of the Titans, I can do some damage to him. Get some health, that's great. I don't get much health from this, but still. Some health is better than none. I'm just so glad I managed to find a Gorgon Eye in the last episode to help me out here. I think I should just go, hmm, I think maybe I should use the Atlas Quake or something, I don't know. It does look like the Chronos Rage isn't doing much damage to him. I didn't think it would because, I mean, Kratos does have, Zeus rather does have some electricity abilities. Right, come on, make a shot. Might as well just try and deflect his attacks back, that'll do some damage to him. Do this at a bit of a steadier pace. Oh, here we go. Got some health and magic back. That is great. Oh my god, what's he doing? Oh, he's got my blade. Right. I've got to use my blades of chaos now. Still, Kratos is, is very good with the blades of chaos, so he will do some damage with this. Okay, over 100 hits. Come on. Come on, Zeus. You asked for this, buddy. 
Oh, I'm getting even more hits. Wonderful. Actually, can I use the... No, I can't use that. Zeus ain't going to freeze. This is doing damage to him, though. Got, got no magic whatsoever, but let's finish this off. Give me the blade. So we're going to topple a pillar on top. We're going to topple a pillar on him. Oh, this is going to hurt. Got some help and magic back. That is great. I didn't get much magic back though, which is a bit annoying. Right, let's do this. Let's do this again. Got the rage of the Titans back to finally help me out. Get get some electricity on him while we're at it. Almost there. Okay, I'm losing a lot of health now. Oh crap. Fucking hell. Well, I've got to flex them back at him. There we go. Got some health back. That is great. Got Rage of the Tides put up again too. Which is good because now I can use the Blaze of the Chaos to do some real damage. Wow. Got some health back. It's great. Come on. I'm just so glad I'm getting quite a lot of health with this because if I didn't, I would really struck at this fight. So we go top of another pillar on him? I just think that just shows how much damage Sorb can absorb. Um, this just kind of shows really how much damage Zeus can take. Well he is a god after all. He is going to transform big again. He knows at small size he is not going to beat Kratos. There was no way Kratos was going to give up this easily. I'm not, I was surprised Zeus even fell for that. Oh, he's going to use Blade to hold him in place. <laughs> he ain't going nowhere. have already deemed me victorious. No, Kratos! Stop! Athena! No! Why do you sacrifice yourself? To save Olympus. I do not seek to destroy Olympus. Only Zeus. Zeus is Olympus. <laughs> he brought this to himself. Because of fear, Kratos. A fear felt by his father, Kronos. A fear that wrought the Great War. A fear that drove Zeus to kill you. His own son. His son? Just as Zeus was compelled to destroy his father, Kronos. You are compelled to do the same. 
no son should destroy his own father. No, I have no father. God after God will deny you, Kratos. They will protect Zeus. Zeus must live so that Olympus will prevail. If all on Olympus will deny me my vengeance, then all on Olympus will die. I have lived in the shadow of the gods for long enough. The time of the gods has come to an end. Remember, Kratos, you have the power to control time itself. The loom chamber is now collapsing, so... Now's what's going through Kratos' mind. He's going to turn back time again. Quite a strong statement when Athena died though. If all of Olympus shall deny me my vengeance, then all of Olympus shall die. That's how far Kratos is going to get his revenge. He's not going to give up just yet. So he couldn't quite kill Susan because Athena interrupted him, but he can always turn time back again. What time period is Kratos going to go to now? Wait, he's going to the war? He's going to, to a time period where the gods had the war with the titans. Is Kratos sure this is a good idea? I didn't slow back, to, I didn't slow down time, did I? Shit. I think I can make it. Just. How could I forget to slow down time? I just made it. No, I didn't. Oh, that was so close. Right now, this time I am going to slow down time. I'm not going to forget after I failed it last time. Okay, so we're going to head to the war. The head to the war the gods and the titans had. This is going to get very interesting. A very risky and dangerous move, but this is just showing how far Kratos is going to go to get his revenge. Expecting you, ghost of Sparta. The gods are far too powerful for us to defeat now. All on Olympus tremble at my name. Zeus is weak. Ares and Athena are dead, and I wield the blade. We can win the great war, but not in this time. Together, we will destroy the petty gods, and we will see Olympus crumble before us. Come with me, Gaia. Return to my time. 
Victory awaits! We have faced far worse than this one fallen mortal. But we are the gods. We whom the mortals worship. We who rule over this land. We who will not be swept aside by this petulant fool. Brothers, put aside the petty grievances that have splintered us for so long. We will unite, we will stand together, and I will wipe out this plague. Olympus will prevail. The end begins. So Kratos has not got his revenge on Zeus yet, but he has a plan in mind. He's going to bring the he's brought the Titans to his time, and they're going to wage a war against the gods. This is going to get very interesting. So that is the end of God of War 2, everyone. I hope you all enjoyed it. The story is only just beginning. The game all builds up the story for God of War 3, and God of, in God of War 3, we're going to be in for a hell of a time. Not only did it go to next gen, but it is filled to the brim with boss fights, and it just builds up more and more to, Zeus, to Kratos' game of revenge on Zeus. I just love God of War 3, it's just such a fun game. I've got it remastered on PS4 as well, so we'll get the best experience out of it. But I am going to end the God of War Let's Play for now, because I want to return to a certain franchise I played last year, but I couldn't play it on my PS4 because the disc wouldn't work properly. But now I've got the PS5, I can finally play the game on my channel. So, before we play God of War 3, I am going to be returning to Uncharted 4 of Thief's End before we can see the God of War story. As God of War 2 entered the series on a bit of a cliffhanger, I thought it would be a good time to end the God of War playthrough for now, but we will return at some point to God of War 3. We can't leave Kratos' story like this. Okay guys, I'm going to end the Let's Play here. Thank you all so much for watching. If you all enjoyed the Let's Play, please be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe. If you want to keep updated with all the God of War videos uploaded to my channel, and I'll see you all soon. This is Goldiex, and I'm out.